So I want to continue the last uh, UDK, <laughs> I mean Unreal Engine 4 tutorial I created, which was uh, how to create a door that you could open and close with two separate triggers and using matinee. This time I'm going to show you how you can add sound effects to that animation. So the door actually creates sound when you open it. That's fun. So this is what I've done now. And then again when I close it. So I'm going to do the same with this door, which as of now sounds like nothing. So the program I use, well one of them, is uh, Cubase. And in Cubase I just created a little, you know, I made the sound, I just, you know. And then just added some effects on it. Uh, actually this one is a little bit different from the first one. So you don't have to use Cubase, you can use whatever you want. Anything that ca can export the sound as a WAV file will do. So I just go to Audio Mixdown in Cubase. This is Cubase 7.5, the newest version. Um, but the first time I exported it didn't work. And it turned out that I had it on 32 bits. And Unreal Engine 4 does not like 32 bits. <laughs> So I had to go down to 16-bit. So remember that. Uh, and I will just export this one as door open close 2. It will be slightly different from the first one. And then just export. And now I guess it is... Yes, here it is. So. This is how you import sounds. You see here in the content browser you have game and then audio and this is where all your audio is. And what you do is you just click import. You can also just, you know, uh, that's wrong. You can also just take this and drag it in there but I like to import it. And you choose your file, open, like that and you can see this little star it means it's not saved yet and you must remember to save always yes number one rule and you can play it yes <laughs> not the best door sound in the world but you know so I'm gonna save it save selected yes and in order to use it you have to create a sound cue so you right click create clue cue I mean and so this has a star so I'm gonna save that one too save selected and now I want to put this cue on the trigger that triggers the opening of the door so the sound plays when the door animation plays so I'm gonna go into the blueprint screen and this is how it looks for the other one Yeah. so I'm gonna go to this door and so what I'm gonna need is a play on location so I'm just gonna write play I guess play sound perhaps, yes play sound at location there you have it. So in the sound, select asset. I'm gonna find door open close to. And then I have to connect it to the play animation. And compile. Let's see. 
Let's see if the first one works. Perfectly. But it still does not work on the second trigger. So back into blueprints and connect it to reverse. Compile. Now this sound is connected to both of them and it should be ready to go. <laughs> this place is filled with animals and they are all making noise so that's why there's so much noise going on. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm starting on the wrong side. <laughs> I can't open that door with the closed door trigger. Play from here. And then the close. Yes. So, that's how you do it. Add sound to your door. 